pushing on up. They need to go in the res onto Rick as the res will take place for Zeus right above high voltage in the meantime getting eliminated. And Leo now, he's had enough. He wants to take the fight here. He spots out a couple of plays. Immediately he just manages to launch himself over the corner. But there was a player waiting for him. It was going to be Zeol, but Zeol not quite able to get the knock. And the blue just pushing on it. It's a battle between the blue and the players. Everyone getting knocked left, right and center. And it looks like... In the meantime, amongst all the pandemonium, P and Crew will be taken down. 7C as well, I believe, are down to the one member. Zeus, even though they've lost two players, two more have pushed on in to safety. And also keep in mind that they are not in the blue zone, which means that the boys from 7Cs are going to take a little bit more damage. And all they have to do is get a high spot. There you have it. Icy is going to have the right idea in his mind. But fair knockdown. They are kind of waiting for that revive to come in. How the tables have turned once more. Mr. Smokey, we too, you have your work cut out for you. The other Mongolian team in the service C line also getting eliminated. Teams are just falling oh, like does. flies right now. XP as a circle is brutal indeed. And it's going to be out in the open. Pretty much a little bit of cover here. And Stalwart Flex. Can we take a look at the map real quickly? Real quickly right now. Stalwart Flex, the two members still alive right north of the circle. The rest comes in for Crypto. And they're going to be heading into the empty part of the zone. And from down south, it is going to be a bloodbath. It's A1. It is going to be A1 going up against 1952. Entry will be taken down. And Jax, remember, the lone man standing. He is based. Basically, not just basically, he's literally in a 1v4. He converted to a 1v3. He's got the right angle. Can he survive though? He's got an AK. He's going to immediately try and make a run for it. But 952 are trying to go in for the finish. And Jax just mounting the over. He's going to find another oh. one, but he doesn't quite get the finish. Does not manage to get the knock. And it is going to be Jax going down alongside A1. Props to C minor for kind of anticipating that move and setting off his flank perfectly. Now they need to cut their loss. The revive is not going to come in, even though he can crawl. Oh, actually, they might just pick up their loss last member but now Godless has an idea with Joker is and Joker his work is going to be cut out he's going to come out of the open he's going to get shot but who's going to take him out as C minor find himself under fire from Stormwood Flex wait how did Joker survive that I don't know there we go he's been finally taken out by IC now to find down to the final three teams and five players left life in a circle this is going to get brutal indeed Crypto is still very much alive Godless has been spotted out by Torfig and Torfig taking damage from the blue and is still trying to get the knock which he will and Godless now on his knees bleeding out it's four alive and two teams in contention IC in a 1v2 because Godless there's no chance for him. There might still be a chance because he has made it to the circle and that smoke deployed up ahead as far as Icy's position go is like the perfect decoy. But the question is, how will Icy make it to his teammate? Because, well, he just might stop Swat Crypto. There you go, a few shots being laid down. And it is a 2v2 situation. But the thing is, I wonder if they know that someone's downstairs. Yes, they do, because Godless was just shot upon. And now, you know what? He just might have given Crypto a chance to move in. But Ozum coming in. Well, that flank guard has been taken out. It's going to be a 1v2, but again, I'm not going to rule anything out against Icy. Icy, 1v2. We know what flows in his veins. It's not blood. It's cold ice. Oh. The flames, however, are going to make it not so icy. That's a Might good force one. him out of his position. That's a fantastic Just Molotov. A little, a little short, though, as he pointed out, XP. And those rocks are on fire for right now. For the time being, though, all... Stalwart Flex have to do is keep him at bay. The circle is not favoring Zeus right now. So what options do I see have? He has to take a fight. He does deal a bit of chip damage on the Crypto. Crypto's got a tree for cover. Does he have any utility remaining is the question. Right now, as far as the comms for Stalwart Flex go, Ozum is definitely going to be keeping an eye on the left side of the rock for his point of view as Crypto makes sure that he covers it right now. Icy does kind of get through. He does have a little bit of a wall for cover, but just barely Crypto is mm -hmm. coming in. I like the fact that he has fully boosted up. Crypto, are you going to make this little bit of a push in? Now, this is just confusion. He wants to make sure he is there while his teammate comes in from the other side. They're playing to perfection, aren't they? Not giving a chance, not a chance in hell for the side of Icy. And in the blue, it is going to be played to absolute perfection. And correct me if I'm wrong, that is Darwin Flex getting the first chicken dinner in the, in the Super Weekend. It is indeed. And we've all been wondering this question that where is that chicken dinner?